Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video and in today's video guys things are starting to look a little bit better. We're kind of coming on the ups and mostly it's not because of my progress. Even though we did make it back to um, rank 19, which isn't, you know, amazing, incredible, but at least we're going in the right direction. I saw a lot of people with my tech once they got to building health, uh, they made it into diamonds. So whether or not by the time we get there, um, it's going to be the same for us. Um, at least we will be going in that right direction. So if you guys haven't already appreciate it, if you throw that code chicken in the shop, does expire every seven days. You guys know the drill. Um, so yeah, aside from that, what else do we got going on? Um, they've had a lot of missions in the Boom Pass that are warships related, so let's uh, collect those. And we'll wait to open everything. We'll do like a Boom Pass video get the new skins and all that stuff, but uh, let's dive back over here. Now, we did make it back to 19, uh, then we fell off pretty good again. The log's been looking pretty similar the last few days. Um, and I mean, this just happens. Like, you guys know how this goes. You guys know how this goes. Um, you're either ahead and you're in diamond, or you're stuck in the, you know, 19, 20 range for a very long time. Um, there was a season, I think it was season 60, maybe? where I don't think I even made diamond until like Thursday or Friday of the last weekend and still made the top 500. So it's not as big of a deal now, as long as we stay true to the path. The mistake that we could make right now would be saying, screw it, I'm just gonna unlock Seekers and then try to push up to 20 and then we're even further behind, right? We gotta have faith in the tech tree and uh, that is exactly what we're trying to do right now. Um, we could add some more stats, but uh, what we want what is this? Uh, it's only 30%. Yeah, what we want is this. We want is this. Of course, we're eight keys shy. Um, actually, we're going to get that on our next chest here. Yeah, okay. Well, that's good news. That's good news. I thought we had to wait till tomorrow. So, maybe we'll have a shot at um, moving up a little bit tonight. Um, but yeah, so, that's where we're at. We did build this new base. Now, I can't say that it's good because... You just saw the log already, so um, I would not copy this one if you're unsure about it. Um, we do have a lot of flamethrowers and uh, microwavers and the sky shield and stuff. So, I mean, it should be pretty good against Seekers, but let's go over the attack next and I'll just show you what we're doing um, on offense. Things have changed up a little bit over uh, since, the, since the weekend and... Um, yeah, basically, we're not doing... we're not really clearing with Warriors anymore. Um, you'll see I do bring in some warriors, but that just depends on the base sometimes. This is a four yard. Wow. Um, we're mo more so using pretty much nothing but bombardiers. So, um, this is going to be interesting because we have max, uh, barrage. So we can actually just throw everybody. I probably didn't need to bring any warriors here, but we can throw everybody on this side. I'm assuming they're not going to go towards the boom cannon on the right. I'm assuming they're going to go on the left. So we shouldn't even have to flare them, which will be good because we want to save gunboat energy for this um, if we can. I don't know how many, it'll probably be three barrage still to take down a, a four engine. Two will be close though. Oh, okay, so that's good. We can do um, two and a critter maybe. Let's see, there we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then these guys can get uh, this one down, no problem. And then if we can get two barrage, actually I didn't need to take out that sky shield at all. But we've already started to do it, so I guess we might as well. And then we just gotta flare really, because they'll get that other engine from across the ramp here in a sec. Uh, let's do a second wind to get some troops in front of us. That this is where the warriors come in handy. Just if you get shock locked or whatever. Uh, we're still a little bit behind. These guys really do not want to stop being bunched up, do they? Okay. So anyways, my uh, critters ended up doing nothing, but whatever. 240. Wow. Could have done that a lot better, but it doesn't matter. So, I love Marina. I love the Marina, too. I love to fish and be on the boat. Oh, man. Um, okay, so that guy fizzled hard. I wonder what he did. That guy was not even close to us in terms of tech, so that's nothing to be, nothing to be too excited about. But I do want to see that attack because that uh, 
it looked like he fizzled pretty hard, whatever he was trying to do. We've seen a lot of rocket choppers out today as well, guys. So, I mean, that is definitely a viable option. So, I would recommend rocket choppers to anyone that went heavy choppers early, thinking that they would be really strong. Um, rocket choppers are very good. They're very fast, and you obviously need the shock bombs uh, to go with them. And especially because a lot of people, myself included, for one of the negative nodes to get bombardiers, took uh, the negative two boom cannons because anything else was just too many um, defenses to lose. So I don't know why this is taking so long. We saw them fizzle. So yeah, rocket choppers are definitely out and about, and we got to be worried about that. Um, yeah, so a lot of different, uh, a lot of different things that are working currently. Come on, end the attack. It's been a long time. I don't know why this happens sometimes. Maybe it's because he didn't... He force closed when he rage quit or whatever. Um, but it's it's very strange because we know the attack is done. I don't know why it doesn't just end. And I hope it doesn't go the full five minutes. But either way, um, let's show you my only other win on the log. Uh, so this was five engine base. He only had a microwaver, which was interesting. And then you see right here, we could actually cut this one up from the bottom. So the max barrage definitely makes a big difference. Um, it, it Typically it's three barrage on an end room. That's if they have zero building health. And it's four if they do have building health. It might be four and some change. You might need a, a critter too. Um, but it really changes how we split up the bombardiers. So, you know, it, we couldn't have dropped from the bottom if we had to get that engine, right? It would have taken way too long. We would have had to split them up. Um, so it allows you to, you know, kind of use all your troops either on the same side or you can adjust your drop kind of accordingly, um, depending on the base. So let's try another one. And we don't always have to use two warriors either. I just have that in because it uh, it helps on the second wins. Um, okay, so this one. This one is interesting. Let's go warrior. One, two, three doodlers. And then I'm going to I'm going to have to pause this one. We're gonna have to pause this one because I need basically that shock launcher, mortar, and cannon trio taken out before I can drop any other troops. So, because I want them both to go on different sides. I'll throw Kavan down here too. I'm thinking, I'm just kind of guessing that range. I'm hoping that they don't track towards that cannon instead of the machine gun. Okay, warriors good. Bombers are good too. Okay, awesome. Uh, that hot pot could get interesting. That was very close. Still might. <laughs> Jeez, we couldn't be closer. Right, let's go one, two, three, and I don't know if we'll need a fourth. Nope, no fourth needed. Um, I will part out the shock launcher. At least try to. Take that out, and yeah, we kind of got kind of got ruined on those shocks. Because I mean, ideally they should have been able to clear a little bit more than that. They just got hung up. I think I should have used the second win. I needed some troops in front of them. Just having them all naked there together, it's kind of tough. So yeah, we need the building health. We need the building health, but we're very close to it. We're 50 minutes away, so. That's where we're at for today, guys. I do hope that helps you out, especially those of you that took the path. Don't worry. There is a light at the end of the tunnel, I promise you. Um, and we got 20 days left. we got a very long time left in the season. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. That is going to wrap up the video today. Make sure you leave a like if it's interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll catch you in the next one, guys. Chicken out. Back, back.